on the channelization of Kolo Creek, stretching from Okakio to Ogidi to the Ogwea areas in uh, Rivers and Bayelsa State. The NDDC Managing Director Samuel Obuku explained that the project aims to lower the risk of flooding in nearby communities. Uh, Joseph Kunde has details in the show. Flooding is an annual problem for communities near rivers in the Niger Delta, mainly due to the overflowing of major rivers and creeks in the area. This year, rivers and Bayelsa states are facing significant flooding. In response, the Niger Delta Development Commission is taking action to lessen the impact on the east-west road and about 17 communities by improving the Kolo Creek's flow. This project starts in the Okaki community in River State and extends into Bayelsa and will boost local trade and reduce the risk of water-related diseases in rural areas. This creek is a nerve connecting the Atlantic Ocean and the Orashi River. So, when the flood water rises, because this creek is blocked, where the water is supposed to go to the Atlantic Ocean has also been distorted. Hence, it comes back as serious flood waters, which has resulted in flooding of the Engena communities from Akinima down to Joinkrama. That is what also affects the cutting off of the east-west road, because the pressure of water that is supposed to be following this route to the Atlantic Ocean has to bounce back. So having come to this understanding, we as a commission, we decided to take it upon ourselves. The leadership of the NDDC is commended for their quick response to the challenges caused by the blockage of the Kolo Creek. Something that we didn't even expect, or that administrations have failed us, but you, the current in this DC have deemed it necessary. We thank God that they will come and remove that tear in our eyes today. The Commission is also working on additional flood relief projects showing their commitment to decreasing the frequent flooding issues in this oil rich region. Joseph Kunde, TVC News, Okaki.